of keeping up with the Kardashians, it seems the real story is just now being told. Are you sorry you did that show? All this time, you had something. I had the story. Oh my God, this whole thing. The one real, true story in the family was the one I was hiding and nobody knew about it. Oh, I got to tell you, I watched. I thought it was very compelling. Here now, Diana Falzone. She is a reporter from FoxNews.com. Also, Bruce Turkel, CEO with Turkel Brands. Um, Bruce, let me start with you. I mean, huge ratings for this thing. So it was the highest demo rating for them in 15 years. 17 million people tuned in. Surprisingly, roughly 68% of them were male. Does that surprise you? It surprises me because you'd like to think that these kind of stories skew female. But I think if you really want to look at the big picture, what we're seeing is a seismic shift in how people look at these sorts of things. This could be so big that at some point, instead of saying transgender, we'll say transgender. He's really changing the way we look at this. Uh, Diana, are you surprised that so many men watch this? Because I have to say, I watched it in my house. My husband was not interested. Well, for, so I was really surprised when I saw these stats. You know, for the millennials, we think of Bruce Jenner as Kim, Kim Kardashian's stepdad. But for those that were there for the Olympics, he was the epitome of hyper-masculinity. So for a lot of men, it was seeing their hero now coming out with such bravery, such, uh, such a big voice for the transgender community. He yeah. is a complete pioneer. And and you know who else he's a huge voice for? Bruce, I thought the most surprising thing about the whole entire two-hour special was the fact that he said he's a Republican. He does not support, he has not supported President Obama. He doesn't like what he did. He said, right. I'm more of a conservative. Are you Republican? Yeah. Is that a bad thing? Bruce Durkell, I mean, this whole interview breaking all kinds of preconceived notions about lots of different things. Mm -hmm. it, it absolutely is. And we were absolutely surprised by that. But and, and it goes further because this is a big challenge for policymakers. What it says is your assumptions are not correct. And we saw something we never see. We saw someone speaking from the heart. And all of a sudden, we understand what it's like to have something so important that doesn't define the rest of your life. This is going to have to change the way big tent parties look at who's involved in their in their actions. Ooh, Bruce Turkel, the big take-home message for the day. Good stuff, guys. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you.